for nine dollars it came with a 12. Ciao friends! Beth with Thimble Hooks. Thanks for stopping by today. Today I'm going to unbox what I found on Amazon as pretty awesome sets for the absolute beginner. So if you want to get into crochet and you don't know if you're going to love it and you don't want to spend a lot of money, I found a bunch of stuff here that I think would be great. And I love my hooks, so hopefully you're going to like what I found. Let's open it up. We found three sets off of Amazon that looked like they would be loaded with goodies. There's all kinds of goodies in here. It's not just a single hook for $30 or $50. All kinds of good stuff in here. But I am going to start out with this one in a box. We're going to see what's inside. This one is called a yoker. Y-O-K-E-R, I think. It's a yoker. It was off of Amazon. All three of these were off of Amazon. And it just has all kinds of stuff in it. It also, funny, I'm seeing a lot of things that are for knitting too, but there's crochet in here. So look what I have. It has a gauge so you can measure your hooks. Got some knitting needles. Well, okay. <laughs> All right, so extra fun if you also are learning how to want to learn how to knit. It can help you with make your cables. We've got a couple of clickers in here. Stitch counters. Those are generally for knitting as well, but it's still fun. A nice little measuring tape. This comes in super handy. You will want this. These come in very handy. Keep that around. These are toppers for knitting needles. This is so funny. There's so much knitting stuff in here. Toppers for your knitting needles. Oh, this is fun. Get extra little walls. So you can set up even more compartments. That's fun. Okay, extra little walls for the compartments. Very interesting. Couple of needles for weaving in ends. Very important for a beginner. You don't have any plastic blunt end needles around. Look, we got a big one and a little one. So that's awesome. I hope you're enjoying my video and my channel. If so, please click that button to subscribe. Thanks. Oh look, I found another needle. That's even better. Now we have three needles. Those two pink ones are the same size. The green one is bigger. There's our hooks. These are steel hooks. They have a plastic handle. The numbers are written right on them. They go from, oh goodness, these are tiny. 0.6 millimeters all the way up to a one and a half. So these are the tiny ones. So if you wanted to start making the tiny toys or really tiny things, because these are bipsy. So this would be a good way to start if you wanted to have your tiny hooks. And then look at all these stitch markers. And you know how much I love my stitch markers. I'm going to try to get all these out. All the little walls so you can build these up however you want to. There's another one. This is another marker for knitting needles. And there's another marker for knitting needles. Funny. Well, this is a nice combo set, I guess. And all of these markers. And I love my stitch markers. And all of these are great for crochet. I love these really big ones like this. But all of these are wonderful. And this was $11 for all of this stuff to start with. So you get the tiny hooks. You wanted to make tiny toys. Or really tiny intricate patterns or lace or any of those. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A nice set of seven hooks. And they are quite nice. Numbers are written right on them. They feel like they're going to stay there for a while too. Has a nice flat spot for my thumb. That's what I prefer. So the nice flat spot you can see. See right there's a flat spot right there for my thumb. And they seem to feel like they have a nice hook on the end. I don't feel any blemishes in the plastic at all. So that is a bonus, huge bonus. So we have all of our stitch markers. We'll put those all right here. Try to get this organized again because it came all flappy. So there's a little bit of knitting in here too, which I think is kind of fun, very fun. But the needles, always need those. A measuring tape, very handy. It looks like it has 
it does inches on one side and centimeters on the other side so fantastic double purpose awesome sauce there's your gauge so you can measure your hooks if any of your hooks have no markings or if it's rubbed off along the way you can still figure out which size you have so that's always good nice to have one of these around and the rest of this stuff is for knitting so there's some stitch markers there's some toppers two stitch counters which can still be used for crochet for sure so this little yoker set would be great if you wanted to start with making tiny things and tiny toys or anything that's really itsy bitsy so there you go there's a wonderful place to start for tiny hooks please remember that it really helps my channel when you watch the video all the way to the end all right, let's move on to this guy. Now this is going to be something similar to that. It's going to have a whole bunch of goodies in it. This one is uh, from Mayboos. Mayboos, M-A-Y-B-O-O-S, I believe. And I haven't opened this yet. Let's open it now. Ooh, look at that. There's a lot of stuff in there, and this is kind of heavy, so I'm excited to see what's inside. Ooh, look at it. Ooh, let's just start taking things out. It's going to be the never-ending never-ending happiness wow this is amazing it's got everything in it oh wow okay so here we have 16 steel hooks for the teeny tiny things you can see how tiny their hooks are tiny tiny tips this is a 0.5 millimeter this is tiny wow that is tiny but it still has a nice hook on the end. This would be working with amazingly tiny things and lacy, super fine yarn. Oofta. But it all goes all the way up to two and a half, which is something that I do use regularly. And again, the tip is nice. The numbers are engraved right into the steel. And I don't feel any snaggies or blemishes on any of these. So that's really good. That's really nice for all of those. I'm going to put those back for right now. Move on to the next pouch. Let's see what's in this pouch. We got our ergonomics with a nice little handle. We got nine ergonomic handled ones. We got a two and a half millimeter right here. Again, nice. No blemishes in this metal that I can find at all that was going to snag your yarn all the way up to a six millimeter right here. And they're all different colors, so you got color coding. So there was seven there. This is a great set. This is a great starter set. Almost anything that you would want to use. At this point, you could go and find any yarn you want and start with it because you have every hook size. That is awesome. And the sizes are stamped right into the ergonomic plastic handle or the rubber handle so they're not going to rub off. Bonus! Nice flat spot right here, as you can see, which is how I hold my hook. I like to have the flat spot. This is an awesome little set. So there's seven ergonomics. This is fun. This has got a lot of stuff in it. These are normal old hooks. No handles, nothing fancy, just good old work with them everyday kind of hooks. And there are a lot of them in here. Goodness gracious, there are a lot of them in here. So let's see what we have. This one's tiny. There's a two millimeter, two and a half. There's a three. There's a three and a half. There's my four millimeter. Four and a half. Five. Five and a half. Wow, we've got some good stuff in here. There's a six millimeter. There's a six and a half. And a seven, which is not typical to get in a set. Very nice. And an eight. And a nine millimeter, which again, not typical. And a ten. This is crazy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen. Almost every size you could possibly want. It's any size you could possibly want because if you need anything smaller than a two millimeter, you need to move into the steel ones anyway. This is crazy. 
And you don't usually get a nine and a seven in these sets. They usually stop at six and a half and maybe throw in an eight, but you don't usually get a seven. So that's kind of cool. So let's see what kind of little trinkets we've got in here. This is miscellaneous stuff. Okay. But again, this is a starter set. This is, I would say, this is a great starter set. We have a gauge for measuring in case you have hooks that don't have any kind of numbering on them or it's worn off. There's a little package of colorful stitch markers, which you know I love. Generally, you would use these for knittings, but there are times where these can be very handy, especially if you're working with anything Tunisian. If you're moving on to Tunisian at all, those can be very handy. And lastly, this makes me happy. This is a really nice set of needles. Wow! This is a nice little set with its own little case. Look at that. Let's see how many we have in here. Wow! Nine different sizes, different eyes, different eye sizes, different bluntness, different widths different lengths of needles and their own little case so that they don't lose them. Check that out. That is pretty amazing. And all and a beautiful little carry case for all of it. And guess what? Drum roll. $15 guys. $15 for all of this. What an amazing way to start. You have everything from a .5 all the way up to a 10 millimeter hook. Wow! Plus stitch markers and needles. This is amazing. I love it. And it has a carry case. It's actually a nice zipper too. Wow! They put a lot of work and thought into this set for $15. So this is pretty amazing. Again, this one is called Maybus. M-A-Y-B-O-O-S. This is going to be my number one fan right here. I love it. And now our last one. This one is Lefu Baby. Or Lefu Baby? L-E-F-U-B-A-B-Y. Lefu Baby. And this is a set, I believe, of larger sizes, but I just need to get in. Now this one doesn't have a case, so that makes me sad. It doesn't get brownie points for that. So let's still see what's inside anyway. There's more stuff. More stuff and more stuff. Right, and again, this one was called Leafu Baby. And we have, oh, these are all the extra large hooks. So we start at a six and a half, six and a half, a seven millimeter, an eight millimeter, a nine millimeter, a ten millimeter, and a twelve millimeter. So this, these two are for that super bulky, like at least a six, really bulky. But a 12 is usually something you have to purchase separately all by itself. So this is a nice set. If you already have a set of small hooks or of the typical, you know, from four to five and a half range, this would be a nice addition, like a nice add-on. This is nice. So six and a half all the way up to a 12. That's crazy. Let's see what's in the little pouch. All right, so inside the tiny pouch, we've got a nice little handful of stitch markers which I use all the time. It's okay to have tons of them because sometimes they do break. It is very possible that they could break so it doesn't matter how many you have you always wish you had more. Ten stitch markers and a whole handful of the blunt yarn needles with the really big eyes. I got eight. Eight new ones. And they are different lengths. See this blue one right here is really short but the purple one is really long. So almost any needle that you might use or might need for your project for weaving in ends, 10 needles. Bam. And this is cute. Very tiny on a keychain. This must be just minis and a travel size. These are amazing. Oh, this is fun. This is going on my keychain. This is great. So I got a three millimeter, a four millimeter, and a five millimeter. The gold one is the three. The red one is a four, and this one is a five millimeter. That is so fun. <laughs> They're really short. Might take a little bit of practice to be able to use something that's this short. Once you have a little bit more experience, you'll be able to use this on the go, in the car, or on the airplane, or something like that. That's really fun. So again, this one is 
the Lifu Baby, and all of this, including a 12 millimeter hook, was $9. Again on Amazon, $9 for all of this stuff. Everything is engraved right into it, so these numbers aren't going to wear off. I am not finding any blemishes in the aluminum at all, not even a one that might snag my yarn, which is important. And it has a 12, which is crazy. Usually you have to buy these separately. And all of this for $9 is pretty crazy. Pretty amazing, I think. All three of these would be highly recommended by me. And these were new ones to me. I had to open them all brand new today, but I'm excited to have these part of my collection. So thanks for stopping by. Thank you for supporting my small business. Please subscribe to Thimblehooks. Tell all of your friends about me and stop back really soon. Thanks. Bye.